are Jenna Hanchard and St. Brian. Hey, Jenna and St. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. You know, Jenna, Han Jenna, we just got you back from the hurricane. Yeah. Now we're going to put you into an earthquake. I know. This are you ready for this? Intense. I'm definitely ready for this. All right, so we're going to go inside this spectacular earthquake trailer, and we are told that we are going to experience like a like a major earthquake. Yeah, an I think it's supposed to be like an 8.0 magnitude. I'm actually a little scared. A little bit, a little bit, but I think we should be able to make it out. All right, well, let's go. Let's see what <laughs> this is like now. All We've right. We've got Trevin Reese here. He is with Ready America. Trevin, what is this all about? So this is our earthquake simulator. Today we're going to experience about an 8.0 earthquake. The whole goal of doing this is to train people up on what to do if there was an actual earthquake. Mm -hmm. uh, you guys have a major fault line up here, the Cascadia sub subduction zone. So it's really important that we get you guys prepared and you have your emergency food, your water, your first aid, uh, emergency three day backpack. So the main thing with this is we're going to experience 8.0. So it's the drop cover and hold on. So we're really excited to have you guys in there with us today. Right, Let's yeah. get in there. Let's yeah, get in there. Let's do it. this. Yeah, with an earthquake, you've got absolutely, you know, no advance warning. You no, know, absolutely not. Hurricanes, yes. Yeah. Volcanoes, yes. But earthquakes. Here, no advance warning. Nothing. Yeah, so there's going to be no warning for you guys. So that's why it's absolutely crucial that you guys are prepared in advance for an earthquake. So what does that mean? So that means getting yourself uh, a kit, uh, making sure you connect with your family, having a good plan, because uh, you never know earthquakes can happen just like that. So. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I was not ready. <laughs> I was not there you ready. go. <laughs> Wait, so that was an 8.0? Yeah. Oh my goodness. That felt, uh, yeah. And so what happens? We see all this stuff is so, on the ground. Yeah, this may just be teddy bears and some plastic cups, but imagine this being broken glass. Oh my goodness. So we have items from Ready America that you can actually secure your entire home, uh, your workplace, and prevent any accidents uh, during an earthquake. All this stuff is preventable if you are prepared and have a plan and have a kit. Um, so that's what we really our main focus is for you guys. So, but beyond the kid, I mean, if something happens like that, because I wasn't ready for that, my heart just yeah. went up yeah, into my. Yeah, you feel it. Oh my goodness! <laughs> but like, wh how am I supposed to stand? Where am I supposed to be if that something like that happens? So, drop, cover, and hold is the main thing that they teach you. Okay. Uh, you want to get under a desk, a workstation, a dining room table, anything that is sturdy, and then you want to make sure, the most importantly, is to cover your head. Um, okay. You want to protect yourself. That way, you can go and protect others around you, family, friends, uh, kids, relatives. So. And at the same time, this is all, this whole event is, you need to be prepared to watch out for yourself, take okay. care of yourself for the next three days. Yes. You can't be expecting to call 911 yep. in the event of a major disaster. And speaking of that, my friend, the major disaster, Michael King, is with Mark Wright in Everett. You guys take it away. That's us. Thank you very much. Let's talk to some people who are here in line. So we open at 9 o'clock to pass out the free kits. We already have a line that's, oh gosh, it's got to be 100 plus deep. I heard, heard a couple of moms. So I'm assuming your mom since you have a baby here. Is this your baby? That's okay. Right. So why did you come here this morning? Um, just to become more prepared in case of a disaster. And how, how does this one here influence that? Um, a lot, actually, because before having a baby, I never even really thought about that. But now I want to be prepared for her. We should show you. Can we show your baby off? Sure. I mean, the baby should be on TV, right? It's a big moment for her. Oh, she's prepared. She's got her <laughs> bottle there. Bottle. She's ready to go. So, so why did, did the, the recent events have any influence for you? Um, I mean, yeah, I was thinking about it more before, but then my sister lives in Florida. Oh, so. right. There you go. So that's definitely had a huge impact on she this. She said, get something. Yes. Well, this is cool. This is free, right? Yes. Yeah. Good deal. <laughs> Let's talk to this guy over here. So you want to be on TV, right? Every kid wants to be on TV. No? No? No. no. Well, yeah, well, just act like you're not on TV. And let me ask you, so why did you come here this morning? To get a whistle and everything else that they have. A whistle. That's, that's actually true. They you give out whistles as part of your kit. It's kind of fun. to get, And you get a free balloon. Yeah. <laughs> I call one joy. I think you have about 50 people to wait through, but you'll, you'll make it. All right, let's pass it over to Mark right here. I'll duck under here. Mark, I have the bon baton for you there. Awesome. Michael, thank you. I'm here with Tom Wirtz. He's with Ready America. Ready America is a company that builds Thanks, all sir. kinds of kits to help us get prepared. And uh, one of the sponsors today, Tom, it's good to have you here. Thanks for having us. So break down, I'm looking at the catalog here, and oh my gosh, you guys make all kinds of kits. What do people at home need to know if they're just starting to build a kit for the first time? 
Well, the first thing you want to have is food and water and first aid. Uh, think about a lighting source, something to charge your phone. Um, poncho, blanket, things like that, good to have. I'm looking at some of these uh, kits, and I don't know if you can see this, Emily, here. Look at this, you've got rain barrels here. You've got, so you could put this in your garage and have a, a water supply for days. Correct, correct. So um, I'm guessing that what people need to do is kind of assess what kind of kit they need and then customize it from there? You can do that. Uh, we carry one person, two person, and four person kits. Um, we're happy to partner with PSE today and donate uh, thousands of kits for, for the public out here today. So Tom, you're a guy that kind of lives preparedness for a living. Most of us, we don't think about this nearly enough. What, is it, what does it make you feel like today when there are hundreds of people here lining up? This is fantastic and it, it's good to have a starter kit for you at home. Be prepared because you never know there could be a fire, there could be any kind of natural disaster. Yeah. All right, Tom, Ready America, thanks you guys for helping co-sponsor today. Uh, all right, so that's it. Come on out and see us. Nine o'clock is when the kits start going out. In about 15 minutes, we're just off uh, Everett Mall Way here at the Walmart. So I'll send it back to you.